Okay, this is Grandma State of the Spark. How are you doing? If you're like me, you had big plans to take a total month off in December to kind of get ready for the re for the new year. And if you're at all like me, doing humanitarian work of your own, reaching out to other people, building your business, whatever it is, you probably got sucked into a lot of projects. I did too. But look, you've got to take time to, to get ready for the new year. And I love this time of year because I've got my new Moschine. Love Moschine. I hope they never go out of business to start putting things in the calendar taking stuff from my old Moschine and then putting it in my Google Calendar. From there it'll be on my my, um, my tablet, it'll be on my hard, uh, on my desktop and it will hit me right on my cell phone so that all those reminders, all those things. So if you've got a lot of stuff, you've got to put it to the side for a second. You've got to take a moment and just go, let me actually download and get this out of my system. Now, <clears throat> I am assuming that you've gone ahead and done um, my seven day homework or you've done your top 100 document where you've actually been able to sort this stuff out. If you've never done a complete download, it won't necessarily be enough just to kind of do a review from your goals from this year and then start planning out your goals from next year. If you haven't done it yet, you really got to take time to, um, to do a complete download. We can talk more about that. Find me on the website at stateofspark.com backslash contact. Um, but for now, make sure you're doing your download, uh, doing your review for the year. Ask yourself what went well. Ask yourself what went wrong. Chris Gellibo of The Art of Nonconformity is big on that. You can review all of his there. Um, I'm big on having categories uh, and having one to three goals that you want to do for this year um, based on your target for what you want to accomplish over the next three to five years. We know that a lot will change in three to five years. In fact, venture capitalists, if they see a three to five year goal, they know that you're kind of making stuff up. That's just to say that everyone really acknowledges that too far in the future, um, a lot can happen between now and then. So uh, look that direction, have a desire, point your nose in a direction of what you want to try to accomplish by then. But um, take your time, do the review, and check in later.